Yeah, I'll react to that, sure. <laughs> All right, preemptive light. Guys, this is one of the... Had me laughing this hard when I saw this sketch right here, Harry and Paul. They're the funniest thing since Little Britain, what I discovered there just cracks me up, but the American tourist ones especially. So uh, preemptive, like, Catherine Tate show, uh, Nan, Dead TV, and and the Doctors. Oh, is this the his gr nose girlfriend? Original link to the video, top the description, below that link to the Discord. Did I say that? I, I Every, okay. People are saying, like, I have diabetes because I drink a lot of water. You know, I, I, I love water. The only better, like, water is my favorite drink most, the vast, 90% of the time, okay? I like water, if you're not counting beer. But the after, like, a meal, I, nothing beats a nice ice-cold Coke, right? But people, what was I saying? Oh, I have diabetes because I, I drink a ton of water and because, like, w w every day, like, when I eat lunch, I just, I get, go into, like, a food coma every time. Not that I'm, I'm eating a ton. I have ADD. I'm getting off topic. I don't have diabetes. I, I'm not that. Let, this is really funny. Is that you, darling? Hi, Nan. Oh, sweetheart. Thank God for that. Are you okay? I came as soon as I got your message. Oh, you are a good boy. How are you feeling? I'm alright, love. Yeah, I'll be alright. Uh, just let me start over. Okay. <clears throat> Stop. Sorry. Is that you, darling? Hiya, Nan. Oh, sweetheart. Thank God for that. Are you okay? I came as soon as I got your message. Oh, you are a good boy. How are you feeling? I'm alright, love. Yeah, I'll be alright. Just a bit of a shock, that's all. Yeah. When did it happen? Just after one o'clock. Been sat here not knowing what to do since then. I got here as soon as I could, Nan. No, don't worry, darling. You weren't to know something like this was going to happen. How could anybody know? We all take these things for granted, and then one day, bang. What is it? That's your lot. Yeah. Is it just ITV you can't get? <laughs> <laughs> OK. No, love, it's all of them. <laughs> I've been sat here in silence for the last three and a half hours. <laughs> Have you missed many of your programmes? Oh, you know me, love. I don't really take much notice. <laughs> it's just nice to have on in the background for a bit of company, that's all, you know. Yeah. Although I suppose I'll never know what happened to Tanisha. <laughs> Who's Tanisha? Girl on that Trisha this morning. Did you see it? No. Oh, it's unbelievable. She's getting the fat sucked out of her thigh and injected into her backside. Only a young girl she was. I thought they got it the wrong way around at first, but no. She wants to have a bigger ass than she's already got. <laughs> and if you ask me, it was a fair size to start with. You could show fucking cartoons on it. <laughs> I've got someone coming over to have a look at the telly. He should be here soon. Belly. And I've missed me lovely gay boy who takes you to an auction and sells all your old shit you were going to throw at <laughs> Oh, he is clever. It might just be the fuse. Oh, that'll be Danny. Danny who? Oh, Nan, don't start. Danny Shaw. I don't know no one called Shaw. You do? You know his mother, Lou Shaw. She's just come out of hospital. Not Loopy Lou. <laughs> don't you dare say that while he's here. She's been very ill. Not loopy fucking Lou, <laughs> They've never let her out again, have they? Nan, I'm warning you, he's repairing the telly for free, so don't upset him. For free? No, thank you. I don't want no charity. You can tell him to piss off out of it. I'd rather sit in the dark. He's so uh, good. Mrs Taylor, how are you doing? Hello, sweetheart, how are you? Too bad, thanks. Now, let's have a look at this. Oh, you can take it away, darling. I never really look at it. <laughs> I'll put the kettle on. Did Jamie check the fuse? Oh, don't bother asking him now. The cat? Look at it. <laughs> I'll put the kettle on. Did Jamie check the fuse? Oh, don't bother asking him nothing, darling. He ain't got a job. <laughs> Guys, it's gonna drive me crazy. I'm sorry. Hey, darling, I never really look at it. Kettle. <laughs> I'll put the kettle on. I'm an idiot. That would have driven me crazy. I'm sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. 
Did Jamie check the fuse? Oh, don't bother asking him nothing, darling. He ain't got a job. <laughs> now, I'm not going to charge you for the repair, Mrs Taylor, and I don't want any Steve. arguing, OK? Oh, you are a good boy. How's <laughs> <laughs> your mum, darling? <laughs> I ain't seen her about for a while. She's OK, thanks. Ah. She's still at the nut house. <laughs> Nan. Uh, Mum went into hospital for a rest, uh, but she's much better now, thanks. Oh, I am pleased, darling, cos last time I saw your mother, she was down on all fours in the dry cleaners, barking like a dog. <laughs> <laughs> now, I think you must have her confused with somebody else, Mrs Taylor. No, loopy loo! <laughs> Everyone knows your mother. I remember when she got barred out of Tesco's when they caught a pin in a deep freeze. <laughs> Should I just not go? Listen, okay. I, I'm so part of this whole thing. I know it's it's annoying. I I, I want to understand British accents. This goes when they caught a. Everyone knows your mother. I remember when she got barred out of Tesco's when they caught a pin in a deep freeze. Please, please, please help me. Off her fucking nut she was. Pleased to hear she's feeling better. There you go, Mrs. Taylor. It was just the fuse, so I'll be on my way. No, you won't, son. Oh, no. No, you'll take something for your trouble. Now, we've been through this. Uh, 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 uh. No, I won't take your money. Now, be a good boy. It's only a fuse. That's not the point. There's £50. Look, I can't take it. Now, you take it and go and treat your mother to a nice new hat. Well, thank you, Mrs. Taylor. You look after yourself. Ah. Thank you, sweetheart. Very obliged to you coming out at such short notice. Truly, I am. <laughs> what a fucking liberty. <laughs> Fifty pound. Fifty pound. He won't hear five minutes. Greedy little bastard. Man, you offered it to him. He nearly took me fucking <laughs> he was going to do it for free. Mugged in my own front room. <laughs> oh, and he was such a lovely little boy and all. I remember he used to come up here wearing his little cowboy outfit. Should have fucking kept it on. <laughs> <laughs> and a lot of good you were and all. Stood there worried about what side your hair's parted while I'm getting turned over by a man whose mother eats her own shit. <laughs> <laughs> He is so great. I might have seen this one. There we are. Ah, here we go. I've seen this one. Should I just should I continue and finish it? It's it's like four minutes. It was. I've seen it, and I even uploaded it, didn't I? Yeah, guy, I had seen it, guys. All right. Um. So uh, hilarious as always. Uh, Catherine Tate is hilarious, uh, especially like the. Didn't they do a remake? Not, not nearly as good. It's comedy is too uh curtail or fenced in these, and I like that's why I especially like uh older comedy, uh, when stuff was more. I, I I don't want to get in trouble. I, uh, um, and just learning about you know British comedy and British sense of humor differences between American. Uh, and I'm starting to love yours more. So hope you're all doing well. Love y'all. Chin up if not. You'll be good soon. Emotions are fickle, my friend. Bye guys.